Living Mother Speak. It's on there. I discussed, I did that already. Number two, I don't think bashing of this young lady means, like, when you read in this text message that I'm basically sending to her, it's not me going to bash her. I'm just doing that for, um, how do you call it? Because I don't know which idiot try to go on, um, what's the name of that fucking, um, thing? What's the name of that thing? Um, Pig wall. Yeah, I don't know who went on Pink Wall and tried to post some nonsense. I don't know who's trying to get my attention. It is what it is. Um, when people try to like do get your attention and stuff like that, you use it for the betterment of yourself. You don't get upset. You don't argue. Like I, I feel I'm tired of seeing people like arguing and ah, like. People are hungry and people are miserable. Anybody that you see get excitement from anything whatsoever that has to do with any drama are people that are hungry, people that are bored, people that are miserable. I am none of the above. I am quite comfortable. I'm, we I'm happy. My life is well sought out. What I do with my life is try to help other people. So I don't need to try to bring somebody down. And a lot of people hurt people trying to get to another person. You ever, like, basically that person that posts that, they're trying to hurt me. And if they had done their homework, I cannot be hurt. I, I'm, ask any of my friends like nobody would entertain this that know me because they're gonna you know the first thing they said they must stop with her she's a madu man that's what they're gonna say like because I don't care it's like it's like I don't care it's like I don't care it's it's and I'm not talking on it but because people would say but you don't care and you're speaking on it which makes sense but no I'm just having this conversation to cover for people who don't know me or if you're popping up and Basically, what? If they post something to affect me, it won't affect me. It will affect only my son. My son would get upset for me, and I would get upset if I see somebody try to disrespect him. So it's like, it's never like if somebody's coming at me, it's like, okay, I'm fine, I'll take it. But if you post something about my son, I'm going to get so upset. You understand? So I, what I do with my life, I don't read into blogs. I don't I don't follow these pages. I don't read. Like somebody posts something about my son or posts something about me. I don't read. I will just glimpse and then post what I'm trying to post. Meaning like I'll go on there and I'll say, okay, you post something about me. I'm leaving a comment so people could see where I'm, find where I'm at and follow me. I'm benefiting myself. Because that page have over 300 and... Three, 303,000 followers. You know what you could do with so many followers? You could start a business. And that was my old intention, to just gain the followers to come over. Because I was living my life peacefully. I never, like everybody that follows me know that I rarely post. I post like, I rarely post because for me, my lifestyle is really comfortable. And for me to post, it would look like I'm trying to show out on people. And I don't like to show it on people because you have to be grateful for what God bless you with. Because if you're not grateful and you try to show it on people that is less fortunate than you, I feel like you're throwing stuff in the face of the most high. So I don't try to show out. I limit myself to posts. I limit myself to drama. I limit myself out of people business. But if somebody attack my son, I have to speak on it. It, it makes sense. It, it, it's, it's, I carry my son for nine months. If you attack my child, I am going to speak on it. I love my sons, and I have two sons. I love them more than how I love myself. Yeah, he's like, what? You're supposed to love yourself first? No. And that's what I'm talking I love my sons more because they are a part of me. I see myself in them, and that's just it. That's just where I want to leave that at. But... I don't tend to run to so I've been myself. I've built myself as this strong person. And this is the same thing that I was told to Lishi. Like with all the situation that was going on, I was telling her last night. Like you cannot let feed into the internet and do stuff and put stuff out there because you're just hurting yourself. 
because I know what the situation is. I never would expose her or try to, I'll talk about it, but I will still try to protect her because I know where she's coming from based on the fact that I am a woman. I am not going to put stuff out there to hurt her. I, I know the whole situation. I know everything. But people have to understand that this is a young girl. She's young. She's what we people would call maybe immature. She's learning. Everybody make mistakes. I'm not saying what she said, that did is right. I'm not saying that. I love it. Oh, you don't want to bash her because people want drama. I'm not going to give you that drama. And I'm an adult. You understand? I'm a leader. I'm not going to step down off my pedestal to, to, to bring drama to a young girl that I know don't know better than what she did. She's young. So... I, we have no issues. Like right now, she's on my WhatsApp. She's on my WhatsApp. Um, I talk to her. I have no drama with her. She and Skitty Bang issue and how she feels about Skitty Bang. The situation is just bad. It, you know, it's hard for people to, 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 to express themselves and tell the truth when it's embarrassing. And the situation for her is embarrassing. And I just feel like people should just leave it as it is. And just stop. It's just this skilly bang thing. I understand that it's skilly bang around the place and skilly bang is strengthened, but this jacket thing, skilly bang never got a jacket. You understand? Skilly bang and this girl was separated. And if you and somebody is separated and they have a baby and you feel a certain way, he did what he did as a man. I, I, and I respect him for that. That's it. I'm not going to keep going and keep going. I'm not going to continue to feed the drama. People already know what time it is. And whosoever is bashing her, a lot of women that is bashing her did worse than she... I can guarantee. So enough of them probably give her a jacket and them don't even know. And a lot of people where I bash him, I forgot to do the right thing for himself. It's so dumb to me. And, and this is why I can't entertain Jamaican people because then they say, oh, she act like she's better than everybody. Yes, I am better than, than, than the stupidity. I'm not better than somebody else. But my, my mental, you can't attach your mental to my mental because certain things I am not going to do. Like, I'm not going to entertain negativity towards any artist. And I'm not going to entertain bullshit. When I say bullshit, it's like things that people run with. Like, I went on the, uh, I went somewhere, I think it was on YouTube, and somebody said, Oh, him, him do this and him do that, and him sign paper, and, him do, and you don't know nothing about anything. You don't know these two people life and you have a whole history and a whole background of these people life and you don't know anything. And, and, and it's just so sad how the media is and none of us can change the media. If we go into the media and try to express ourselves, we're going to sink ourselves even more, especially when you're not ready or if you address with anger. You can't do that because then you're going to say things and then you're going to sit back and you're going to say, oh, my God, you know, I shouldn't have said that. You're not obligated, nobody's obligated to give anyone any information, anyone, any, like I'm trying to work out things with somebody, it's like me talking right now, like I, on this one, my friend, I have my friends on here, people that know me, people that I respect, but I'm talking to, you're online and you're sitting there with your camera, and let me tell you, me never did go this a last night, these people don't know you. These people don't care. It's just something to entertain. You ever seen Beyonce entertaining people? And I always tell people, when Beyonce starts, stop what she's doing, put Sir and Ray to the side, and she sit down and start entertaining people, then I will do the same thing. Because the, it's not putting money in these people's pocket. I'm taking the time out to say this because... I am telling you guys, come over, come over. I'm going to have a juicy story. There's no juicy story here. I already said what I said once. Me and her talk about it. I told her I was going to tell the truth. She told me it was okay. I told her, we all, like, I tell her from the get-go, you know, I like her as a person. Like, people bash her. People say this. She did not show that to me. I cannot bash somebody that didn't. It's not like I can't say, oh, yeah, you're a bitch, and you're not calling me a bitch. That would be wrong. I don't work like that. And nobody can let me bash her. Yes, yeah, she said some things, and whatever the case may be, people are hurt. And when I'm a woman, me says me, I go say some things. Well, at this age, I would not do that because I'm older, so I'm not gonna like 
sit there and talk about, hey, boy, because I'm older than that. You know, I'm a, I'm a grown-up. I'm not going to drag anybody to entertain other people. But she is young, and I just think, like, it shouldn't reach social media. And like she said, I was upset with her for just one thing. I said, how did that paper reach social media? And she said it wasn't her. Can't drag her again. If we're not with Pam, if we drag her, can't do that. I will just tell the truth. She got the paper first, and that's it. I'm not going to drag her. She said she didn't send it out. I cannot drag her. Probably somebody somewhere, or probably our friend, probably, I don't know where it's coming from. That's none of my business. And, and, and so for people who are dragging her and people who are saying, oh, you're being nice to her. I'm being nice to her. What she do me? Oh, she do your son something. But if me attack my son, I can't send him things. So I can't contradict myself. I don't know what I want. I just want something. Because I'm bored, I'm not hungry. And someone is homeless, someone has teeth, Wi Fi. And I have nothing to talk about. So I just want somebody to entertain, you know, entertain, you know. And which is sad. I wish this, if I was over here saying God is good, like what I want to tell people, like God is great and you can get things out of life and how to pray and how to achieve things and how to manifest things. Like, girl, you want to manifest riches? You want to manifest a private plan? You want to manifest a house in the Hamptons? Come talk to me. I'm helping you pray and we work it all together. You can't tell people for prayer. You can't tell people for, for, for think good, think positive. They don't want to hear that. They want to know how big Skilly Bang Hood is. Well, well, me here said, him Hood is a size 12 and a half. Stay away from him because you're going to go cuckoo for Fruit Loops if I don't know what to hear. Some hear me, I know. Some hear. But as I'm saying, people don't want to hear nothing positive. People want to hear the negative. People want to see people dragged. That's what people... And it's just... It's, it's annoying. So that's all I have to say. Um, you guys, bless up yourself. I'm not dragging anybody. I already talked about the situation once. I have no issue with um, Lishi. I, she's on my WhatsApp right now. I just text her. She texts me. We had text last that we talk about the situation. She don't apologize to me already. Which, which, she apologized to me already. So therefore, me not go all up in my heart. If I have a dollar and she want 50 cents for her child and it's not my son's child because I was the one that was interested in that child, I will still give it to her, she asked me. So anything else? I really don't care and I'm not going to entertain it. So people can run with the fuckery where them see people are post on the internet and continue to run with it and skilly peng take a jacket this and skilly peng take, take a jacket that and I know nothing about the story. Skilly peng never take a jacket. Skilly peng and this girl never did a talk. Skilly peng are living on life. Skilly peng is very nonchalant. Skilly peng don't even go up on the internet and look on comment. If I don't go to skilly peng and say, skilly peng, you know, so I see somebody say your head big, you say, huh? We are talking about the first thing you said to me, Mommy, come on for the internet. When you are a superstar, you're not supposed to be on the internet. I him teach me that. When you are a celebrity, you're not supposed to scroll and I look upon people things. Are people supposed to look upon you and I worry about you? In in that context, I mean, I know that, but I'm just saying, in, in, in nonchalant about bullshit. I'm not going to entertain it. No matter how not post or not, it's not shaking him. I mean, I'm not dying now. I mean, I'm not give a fuck, you know. I'm not doing research. Oh, 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 I'm not doing a research. Okay. Hmm. Oh, well. Um. <clears throat> people need to get a life. The time people take a sit down and a fork, and people on that right paragraphs about people who are not even give them the time of the day. Them do this to my friend, them, them do it to my cousin, them do it to everybody that I'm in a circle with on the pig wall. Them just sit down and them write paragraphs on all of them girls. Yeah, I drive Benz. Who not drive Bentley? I drive Porsche. Who not open business? Uh, who I live them life? And the people, them, when I have nothing I go on for them, not even two pieces of teeth in clothes, and not even nothing, nothing at all. Nothing. More than the command, we are come dig them out when, 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 when light gone. Sit down and just a write paragraph and I try bash people. Get it together. Get it together. Like, 
Oh no, oh no, different door. Me not lie, me couldn't do it. Um, I, I, I really sometimes wonder if... I scrap, Mr. Me have a come up, Mr. Lachat. But no, this is interesting. We really need to talk about this now. We really... It's like when you go on YouTube and you, try and you see something pop up. I, and you see your artist, whether it's Killy Bang, in, Intense, Alkaline, and you see something pop up on Alkaline, Drop Dead, or Intense, Lock Up, or and when you're nothing, it's Killy Bang, and none of the two of them not true. It's like this forcing of lies, this forcing of negativity, this forcing of bullshit on the own people. This forcing, this forcing of bullshit and then people just run with it like run with something and them not hear it from the source them not know nobody them not ask no question them not you know inbox skilly bang and say hey skilly bang what's going on can i ask you but i even read my message because people are celebrity build a certain way if uh, unless you're emotional like you have to go up on the internet and start posting your life and posting your stuff emotional. Man not supposed to emotional and post nothing. Supposed to be a man and hold it. No matter if the world come at you, you're supposed to be a man and tough it out. That's why you're a man. And me supposed to sit down and complain. Woman supposed to sit down and in a bag of chatting. Especially when it's not true. Especially when it's not true. You're not supposed to entertain it. Because what we as Jamaican people need to understand, if I look in the camera right now and I say, you know, I'm telling you the truth, skilly bang this and skilly bang that, I'm going to tell you the truth. I'm going to put my hand high, I'm going to tell you the truth. And tell you everything tomorrow. If you want to bash me because you don't like me as a person, you don't like me because I'm not a vendetta. You know, like me because me, uh, me, me say Plaza or Gaza, Gaza. You know, like me because me say Isa. You know, like me because me say Yang. You know, like me because just something where intrigue you at the moment will catch you. Yeah, that just tear me down. It's just psycho. So when me I go stop, when me I do know. When me I go stop, when me I do for sit down and upon. Um, you know, and this is why this is the only thing I was I said to Leshi that was that pissed me off. I said why. You entertaining people. Why you feel like you have to go and explain yourself? You only make yourself look so bad. Like, don't explain yourself to people. They don't care. Because all the mother see is the, the fact. All the mother see is the fact and run with it. You try to get skilly a jacket. You try to get skilly a jacket. Them now go look on the fact say, you love him. Them now go say, you know some of feel to that girl because me, to me, have sense. You see, to me, I've sent some an idiot and to me, no things. Me, I go say, which woman I go get up and take up themselves and I kill up themselves and I explain. And for you look on her video and her look on her, <laughs> her, her eyes and how she attack, you can't tell so she in her feelings, she hurt. You can't tell so she love the person. She love Skitty Bang. She have Skitty Bang name tattoo. Yes, so? Yes, so? Big. Is. She loves silly bang. You understand? So, she got hurt if anyone, if it happened to anybody, anybody would have hurt. And if the internet had dragged me and me can say something to make myself feel good because people are tearing me down, me I go say it. Even if it have probably hurt the next person. Well, me at this point in my life, me not care. No matter where you are, me help you drag me down. If you said a girl like this, me go say, yes, I'm true. Yes. Because you know God love me already, I'm a bless. Because I write them a lie down, I'm a say, Father God. You know, say, I need $5,000 for buy one bag. By next week, I just see you up. I don't know what kind of God me I pray to, because I don't know how obsessed with me, so. I don't know how God love me, so. Something not right. I forgot to check out myself. Because. Well, maybe because I stay away from people, I don't mix it. I keep my heart clean, I tell people the truth, I love it, I kind, I feed the poor, I feed the homeless, I gig, 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 gig. I don't know what it is. Or if it's a karmatic thing, maybe. But, 
the girl love skinny bang no matter what she wants eh? no matter right now no matter if she should arrive much much my life right now she knows she can't tell me nothing she can't tell who knows she wants to know she can't tell me that but i mean i feel like it right for bashar she's a young girl okay i mean i want to talk about that story no more it's just an unfortunate thing you understand and i wish like it never happened for both of them i don't know what caused them to fall apart but them fall apart a while now like maybe when she was three four months pregnant i don't know if people them like community don't like her are people who know i don't like her and probably say something to skinny thing and then take for himself but you know it's, it's, it's just an unfortunate thing it's unfortunate it, it's so unfortunate for the two of them are fake because i don't judge women it's not my place to judge a woman and if you sit down and judge a woman and act like say you're better than the next woman and you're so perfect that not make it so um yeah that's all i have to say about that and people just need to start loving themselves before me go up on the social media and follow up nobody lies me go beard and lotion my skin make it soft so when me go so put on something sexy woo, the time before me chat nobody or call nobody in on a mix up like i haven't spoke to none of my friends i must speak, speak to one of my friends today and it was briefly i must speak to my cousin today briefly but when i sit up on the phone with people it's like those were when i was 20 25 you know 30 i stopped those things like now that i'm older you understand soon gone up in the big number them you have to start change you know you have to start change yourself you know everybody's like oh you're what 35 37 and you have a 20 year old body yes i am blessed because i keep myself and my mental good when i keep myself mixy them thing that lower your energy and lower your frequency and some people wonder why some people look younger than them and them think it's cream and makeup and all these other stuff and it's your energy if your energy is down everything about you down and when you're in mix up and mix and argument and carry or bring come it lower your frequency so it lower your body it lower everything your mental it drains you but other than that that was my life and for those of y'all who thought i was gonna throw some super true people under the bus I, that was me being sarcastic because i w i never i never post on my page for when was the last time i post shit i post song a couple of days ago um i don't post so when somebody send me this in my dm and for anybody that's watching anything you see on any social media please don't entertain me don't tag me in it don't inbox me because i'm not gonna go and read it anyways i'm not gonna i'm, I'm not going to entertain it the only reason why i entertained it this because i was speaking to leshi and when i said to her this is how you handle mix up and basically what i was saying to her is to take the, what people are saying and what people are chewed at you and the people them will follow you for the mix up use it go open a shop get the followers them open, start sell ear start sell clothes start do something let's see what this person is saying okay start sell here start sell clothes start do something with it positive like turn that negative around in into a positive don't let that negative affect your life because you can't change people's perspective of you especially jamaica people it's just like how we sit here right now calm and quiet at a which i would this hi let me see who is this uh Okay. Mama, I almost cut off my life.